Yo, what is up guys? It's Retro Giraffe. Welcome back to my channel. Hopefully everyone's doing well. If you saw my previous video of my Japan mail time where I unboxed a bunch of things that I bought from Miyabi Hobby, this is one of those items. And as you can see in front of you, we have the Charizard VMAX deck. And this one does feature the Charizard VMAX. Unfortunately, there is only one. But before we open it up, let's actually take a quick look at the box. So on the front, we see Charizard. It's like a rainbow pattern with like the clouds. And I believe we do get a playmat of this. So I'm very really excited to see that. It's not a cloth playmat, but it still is a paper playmat, so I think it's still pretty cool. So we have Charizard VMAX on the front, and we see the little text up here. I'm pretty sure that says Charizard VMAX to some degree. And then the sides, just kind of continuation of the front. And then if we look at the back, we see that we have the Charizard VMAX featured right there. We get two Charizard Vs, which is pretty cool. Um, like I said, that paper playmat. Um, some damage counters and the deck itself. Also, we get a coin and this is a deck list and also this is a fire and fighting um, I guess deck featuring Colossal as well. So yeah, without further ado, let's crack it open and see what it looks like. Let's slide everything out. Move this box off to the side. And we're starting off with, if I can get it out, there we go. We have this Charizard VMAX, and it's such a nice card. Um, I love Japanese cards because the quality is top-notch. It's so much better than English cards, in my opinion. But as you can see, we have the Charizard VMAX. And this, along with this Charizard V, will be featured in the Darkness of Blaze set that's coming out on August 14th. But the full art version and also the Rainbow Rare of the VMAX will be featured in Japan tournaments only at the moment. So um, in order to get that, you would have to pay crazy amounts. Um, I recently saw an article where a Rainbow Rare sold for, I think it was five grand. I would put that article up, but then it was a crazy amount of money. I don't know the exact amount, but it was a lot of money. But I'm sure that here in the United States, we're gonna get it eventually in some way, shape or form. But just to hear the price that it was sold for is just insane. But we have, again, this Charizard VMAX. Such a nice looking card. And personally for me, I love the VMAXs because like the rainbow swirls in the background. I think it really helps uh, the Pokemon and the card just stand out so much more. And yeah, let me actually put it in the sleeve before I forget. And there we go. Very nice. And also we have this coin right here. So we have a Charizard VMAX coin. I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to see that. But it has like a glitter pattern. Similar to like, you know, the rainbow, not the rainbow, the VMAX pattern. So it is like glitter compared to like a shatter foil design. And also this coin is a lot smaller than um, traditional coins. Um, I don't know how to explain it, but it is a little bit smaller. But yeah, so we have the coin right there. And we have the deck here. And before we get into this, let's actually look at the other things that this um, comes with. So it's neatly packaged in this little plastic sleeve. Like, I gotta give it to Japan. Like the way they package things is just so... I don't know, it's so like organized, it's so neatly done compared to like English stuff where like if you guys remember the old Elite Trainer boxes, they just threw everything in the box and then now they have like those cardboard inserts to like separate everything, so a little late, but I mean I guess Pokemon USA is learning but we have the damage counter, so this is one side, this is the other side it's very, uh, it's very colorful, unfortunately these are like cardboard so um, it's not really that, I guess um, it wouldn't last a long time compared to like dice, but still cool to have. I guess this is a QR code for something. I have no idea what this is for, but we have a QR code. And we have this pamphlet of how to, I guess, play the game. So I'm sure it kind of starts like here. So this is the front, I'm assuming. And then it kind of shows you, I guess, the different ways that you can play a card, the different synergies. I'm assuming, I really don't know. And kind of like the layout of like, you know, a regular TCG matchup. So you have like your prize cards, your bench, your active and all that. And here is the back side. So very nice. If I can fold this back up correctly. And let's actually open this playmat up. So it's actually a pretty big playmat. So okay. So oh gosh. Okay. I don't know if this is all gonna fit, but we have this Charizard VMAX. Rainbow Rare, Rainbow Pattern, Playmat, 
And this is a two-player playmat, as you can see. So we have the battlefield, two spots. We have the prizes. I'm trying my best to like finesse this, but we have like the prize cards, then your opponent's deck and their discard pile. It's a very nice playmat, especially for it to be paper. It's still a pretty nice quality uh, paper. And if we see, is there a back? Oh, nice. Okay, so there is a back. So. As you can see, it kind of lays out, you know, like where you put your actives, where you put your prize cards, where you put your, I guess, um, decks. So it's a very nice playmat. Um, very helpful for people who want to get into the trading card game, so very nice. I'm definitely going to try to keep this in good condition so that, you know, one day, one day in the future, I could maybe use this with my friends. So enough of everything that comes with it. Now let's get into this little deck right here. So I believe there's a little seal. If we open this seal up, and we get the Charizard V card right here. And I believe we get two of these, so one and two. Let me quickly sleeve these up real quick. So there we have it. We have the two Charizard Vs along with the Charizard V Max. So again, these cards will be featured in the new Darkness of Blaze set coming out in August 14th. So please uh, keep your eyes peeled for that. I will be getting a booster box along with Elite Trainer boxes and I guess other things that um, will feature the product. So yeah, look forward to that um, coming August. But these are the, I guess, holographic cards. Put that off to the side. Actually, I'll put it somewhere outside of the glare. And then we'll get into the deck. So we have a Victini. We have Zygarde. roly Coley. We have uh, Torkoal. Colossal, Tauros, Quick Balls, Incense, you know, Rare Candies. All the things you really need to, you know, have a decent deck. We have the Pokey Kids, we have Hop, we have uh, Milo, a bunch of Fire Energies, I'm assuming, and a bunch of Fighting Energies. But yeah, so the biggest draw to getting this, I guess, um, deck is these cards right here, mainly this Charizard VMAX, because um, I believe this is the only way that you can get it in the Japanese sets, because I don't think they've released it in their Explosive Walker and the Forbidden something. There are two Japanese sets where it kind of equates to our English set. But yeah, so um, we have these cards right here, and that is it for this opening. So we get these holographics, this coin, um, the deck, and a bunch of little... Um, Things on the side like this damage counter, I guess the how to, and also this playmat. So, yeah, that is it. I know it's a very short video, but hopefully, you guys enjoyed this. I'll be opening up the other two Legendary Heartbeat booster boxes in a future video, so please stay tuned for that. I'll be opening all 40 packs um, in both booster boxes. So, hopefully, we can pull two more amazing rares because I believe it's one per box, and also, hopefully. We can pull one of those gold cards, especially that's shiny orange guru. But yeah, that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. And if you guys want more content like this, especially those two um, legendary heartbeat booster boxes, please subscribe because those videos will be out very soon. And yeah, that is it. Um, thank you guys again. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.